Good afternoon, church family. Today is Monday, October 3rd. Uh, I am so grateful to be back with you. Yesterday was a wonderful day of worship as we gathered around the Lord's table and celebrated communion together. Uh, what a joyful time. Thank you, church, for allowing Myra and me to go on a vacation. Uh, even though it was cut a little short in Florida, we continued it back here in North Carolina, and the Lord just blessed us. Uh, so I feel refreshed. I'm glad to be back with you. And uh, I have for you just a few things uh, that are coming up in the month of October that I need to make you aware of. First, this Friday, our missions team is hosting a pregame football meal for West Cabarrus High School. This is the newest high school in Cabarrus County. Uh, it's, I believe, the very first time that we're able to host them. So I want to invite you out. If you'd volunteer and help serve or help cook or help clean up, Maybe just help greet uh, this coming Friday. Uh, please get in touch with Alex or Pastor Aaron, and uh, they will uh, connect you with the opportunity to serve this coming Friday. This coming Saturday morning, our Men on Mission is hosting uh, their fellowship breakfast. Uh, this is the first time we're trying it on a Saturday, and so I'd like to invite you men to come out. Uh, see what it's about. It's 9 o'clock to 10 o'clock this Saturday. Uh, we'll try to keep it prompt and uh, short. It's not too early in the morning so that you have to get out of bed on your day off, but it's also not too late where it interferes with the rest of the day. So we've tried to think through all of those things about having it on a Saturday, uh, but we just invite you to come out and be a part of what God is doing here at First Baptist Church of Concord, especially through their Men on Mission ministry. The following week, Saturday, October 15th, our women's ministry, our Hope Women's Ministry, is sponsoring Paint to Praise. And so, ladies, see Claudette Fowler. Uh, sign up. It'll be $15 for your um, uh, all the things you need in order to uh, paint, the materials there. And so, please contact her. Be a part of this. This is always a, uh, an enjoyable thing. You'll be painting a Christmas scene and so I hope, that, uh, I hope that you'll enjoy it and avail yourself of that opportunity for fellowship. Uh, on Wednesday, October 26th at 6.30, uh, I will be hosting a discovery class. This will be for new members. Now, I know this is going to be crazy, but this is new members all the way back uh, until uh, 2020. That was the last time we had a new members class or a discovery class. So if you're a new member over the last three years, come out and be a part of this. Also, if you're a prospective member or you're a visitor and you just want to know more about who we are at First Baptist Church, come out and be a part. Uh, if you want to eat with us, uh, our supper on Wednesday evenings at 530, please call the church office if you're not already on our Wednesday evening uh, meal list. But I'll just tell you, if this is the first time you're coming out or you're just coming out for this evening, let, let supper be on us. Let us provide your dinner that evening. Come out, be a part of our fellowship meal. And then at 6.30, I'll be hosting that dis, uh, discovery class. And so I'll invite you to be a part of that. On Thursday, March, <laughs> on Thursday, October the 20th, uh, Man Church is going to be had. It's always the third Thursday of the month. So at 6.30 on the third Thursday this month, October the 20th, come out and be a part of Man Church. Uh, we'll have a good time together. It's always well attended. The food is always good. Uh, the singing may not be always good, but at least we sing to the Lord. Uh, we obey Him by praising Him, and uh, we do it as a bunch of men together. Uh, by the way, it's only bad because I'm leading it. It's not bad because of our men. They sing great. And then finally, our Young Hearts Mountain Trip is uh, Thursday, October 27th. Come out and be a part of that. Uh, it's a little over $50. $25 is for the bus. Uh, you may think, well, that's a lot of money. But this is the availability or the ability of our, uh, of our senior adults to travel in style on a very nice bus. If, uh, if money's a problem, speak to Pastor Aaron or myself, and we'll see what we can do for you. Uh, but it's $25 for the bus, and then a little bit more than that uh, for lunch. They're going to, um, they're going to eat uh, the Daniel Boone um, eatery there, and so everything's taken care of, tip, all of that is included in the price. But uh, come out and be a part of that. It's a good time for our people to be, be together. 
Um, it'll, uh, you'll have the opportunity to buy some cheese or some candy from the cheese store. You'll have some opportunity to eat together and then to pick up some uh, apples on the way back home. So it's a great trip, lots of fun. Uh, you may want to give yourself the opportunity to be a part of that kind of an event. Uh, let me encourage you as we head into our holiday season. Uh, I'm about to tell you that on Sunday night, October the 30th, we are going to have our fall festival. And that really officially kicks off holiday season because it's from the end of October into Thanksgiving time in November into Advent season and then also to our celebration of Christmas. So we're really about to enter into our time of celebration of all the holidays. But as we do, let me encourage you. You will be a great encouragement to your church family if you just show up. If you're here on Sunday mornings as we worship, if you're here at our special events as we celebrate the holidays. And the only reason why I say this is sometimes you think that you may not be missed, that you may uh, be able to skip out of church and nobody really cares or nobody wants you there or some other lie that the enemy gives to you. And I just want you to know that you are missed when you're not here. We love for you to be here, not just so that we can count your number, but so that we can see you and enjoy you and spend time with you. So friends, make it a point over the next three months to avail yourself of every opportunity you have to be with the body, to stir one another up to love and good works, to not forsake the assembly of, of together uh, as we gather of brothers and sisters, as we gather together in worship. So come on out, be a part, find something that fits you and jump in right there. Be a part of all that God is doing here at First Baptist Church. Join me as we join others in loving Jesus, in loving others, and making disciples all over the world. So God bless you, church family. I love you. Have a great day.